This is a day I've been looking forward to since the idea for Fire Breathing Sharks was first conceived. It's the day I get to punish Riley. Mm. Now, I probably wouldn't normally feel this way because I tend to feel uncomfortable about inflicting discomfort on other people, but Riley's been very vocal about the fact that she wants to punish Robin and I, and she broke her own rule less than a month after she made it. So I really don't think um, that I have anything that I need to feel bad about. We still sort of do, though. Are you kidding me? We're still doing this? Okay, fine. What do you mean we? You and me. I'm the nice Rachel. See? I have a bow. Lovely. Thank you. You're welcome. Explain why we feel bad again. We like Riley. We don't want to make her sad. She'd do it to us. But we like Riley. You're kind of creeping me out. Um, and if we make her punishment too bad, then she's, she's just going to do it right back to us when... When, when she gets to punish us, and I don't want that because... Oh. Well, you're clearly the stressed out, self-conscious, self-doubting me. But you have made a valid point. So... I know what I'm going to do. Um, just one second. Hey! Yeah, you didn't show up today. Yeah. Really? <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, I kind of need you, though. You know, because we have to do Riley's punishment, and yeah, nice and self-conscious are kind of running the show, and I'm pretty sure that that jerky mean one is around here somewhere, too. Yeah, we really need you. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, she should be... That was fast. Okay guys, she's been in some of my videos before, but you haven't actually been formally introduced to hat-wearing Rachel. Hey! You might recognize her from such classics as... And... Garbage can. The rest of us really love her because she's just so comfortable in her own skin. Hat-wearing me loves being silly and she loves the creative process and she's just honest about who she is. See, she's she's fun, but she's still level-headed. And I think I'm just gonna turn this whole video over to her now. <laughs> Thanks, Rachel. Uh, so, since I'm you, I think I pretty much understand what's going on. Yes, Riley is our friend, so we don't want to make the punishment too terrible. Um, but, uh, this is all in good fun, so let's make it something entertaining. Uh, I think we should brainstorm. Any ideas out there that you want to shoot my way? I think we should give Riley another chance. We like Riley. We don't want to make her sad. I think we should just kick her out because that not saying prime numbers rule is really stupid anyway. And when she's gone we can just abolish it. Alright, neither of those are an option, but thank you. Anyone else? I think Riley should have to make a sock puppet Riley and then use it to make a video about how it was very foolish of her to break her own rule. Now that hat-wearing sock puppet Rachel is a great idea and I actually think that's what we should go with. I knew bringing in hat-wearing Rachel was the right choice. Okay Riley, what's gonna happen is this. If you want to appeal this punishment, you have your next video to do so. If you choose, you can just complete your punishment right then. Um, if you appeal, Robin gets the final say about whether that is the punishment that you will complete. So basically you have the next two videos to complete your punishment because I don't want to put any pressure on you to do it at one particular, uh, in one video or the other. Anyway, there you go. Um, that's all because we jam-packed a lot in here. Um, say goodbye everyone. Bye. 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 <laughs> Riley, all of us will see you on Wednesday. Why does British sock puppet Robin sound so Australian? <laughs>